Venezuela's vice president is calling on supporters of Hugo Chavez to try to stop the rumors about the president's health. Speaking on Venezuelan state television, Nicolas Maduro said that he'd seen Hugo Chavez twice in recent days. He said that Chavez is fully aware of how complex his condition is. The 58-year-old hasn't been seen publicly since his cancer surgery three weeks ago. They are praying for their president. Mounting concern over the health of Hugo Chavez has led to questions in Venezuela whether he will be well enough to attend the swearing-in ceremony next week. His chosen successor, the vice president, has spoken from Cuba. The coded language suggests problems for the OPEC nation may lie ahead. He is completely aware and conscious of the complexity of his post-operative state and he expressly asked us to keep the people informed, always with the truth, regardless of how hard it may be. He is in a complex situation, and we are at all times waiting for his positive evolution. How long can the country wait as the 58-year-old president undergoes treatment following his fourth operation in Cuba for cancer? There has been speculation the swearing-in ceremony could be delayed or moved to Cuba. That would not be constitutional, say the opposition, who argue new elections should be held to choose his replacement if the president cannot make the January the 10th date. Chavez is meant to be sworn in for his fourth term as president on January 10th. Yet given his condition, many believe that won't happen. If he's deemed incapacitated before then, the Venezuelan constitution says new elections must be called, a scenario that would sow upheaval across the country. The government has yet to inform the Venezuelan people what kind of cancer Chavez is suffering from. Chavez uh, has uh, wanted to keep this a secret. He succeeded in that, and uh, he's been able to do it because he got treatment in Cuba. And uh, the Cubans are very good in keeping secrets and uh, that was for him a high priority. Chavez has not been seen in public since December 10 when he left for cancer surgery in Cuba. And unlike prior occasions, the socialist leader has not made any phone calls to state media to let people know about his medical condition. 